Man, we've had to come to Mess Village so much. This is a really long side quest, by the way. I did not expect this side quest to be this long. I hope the other girl in Foodtopia has a way easier side quest. All right, so the windmill is over here, isn't it? At least I thought it was. Yeah, it's like right here. Can I like... Oh, there's something written here. I was right. Let's go. The king of birds which has forgotten the sky. The king of birds which has forgotten the sky. What does that mean? Could it be a hint to the treasure? Dude. I'm actually a genius. I think I just know this one. I bet you. I, I would bet. Like, I wouldn't actually bet anything because video games can be weird. But like... I would make a theoretical bet that it's talking about the penguin. It's talking about the penguin fossil. An emperor penguin? A king penguin? Penguins are birds that don't fly? I bet you it's the penguin. It could also be the lines of the bird. That's, that's, that's probably a more fair guess. But man, I really, really hope it's the penguin. Because that just is so funny to me. Definitely, I think, either way, the answer has to be in was up. Because then it'll have taken us to, like, every area. Wrong button. Fire! Why did I do that? Ow. Oh, I'm on Zenny Finder. I was like, oh, just spam your five damage rapid fire. It does not do, uh... Did you just try to predict it? it? Does not do five damage right now because I'm trying to get some more money. The reward better be worth it. I'm going to tell you right now, this reward is only really going to be worth it if they give me, like, an HP memory 20. Now, I know what some of you might be thinking. Like, just 20? That's so little. But, like, literally every bit of HP you can get in the game for free is worth it. If it's just HP that you don't have to equip a skill for. Also, I made a horrible mistake in switching into ninja form against the puffers. I remember playing the ninja version of the game and playing the ninja... Oh my goodness, sorry about that. Playing the ninja version of the game is the literal worst when you're up against these guys. Because the charge shot is so bad. But, like, the only rewards that could make all of this running around worth it is, like, they're probably going to give us a stupid cipher or something that I don't care about. But the only things that, in my eyes, would be worth it is, uh... No, wait, we're going to what's up. Would be HP memory plus 20 or, like, a level 3 card that we don't have yet. Those are the only things I would consider worth. Personally. Goodbye. Oh, wow, I got them both. Nice. I swear, 90% of the time that I get, uh, like, Thunderbolt Blade and Link Force Big Bangs, I think they're called, 90% of the time when I get those, it's only when I've, like, won the fight anyway. We did do all the side quests here and was up, didn't we? I'm pretty, la I'm pretty sure last stream we took a lot of time to do those side quests. I feel like we did. We might have missed one or two somewhere. I don't know. Here's the bird. This is a picture of what is said to have been the Mew lookout, a bird that watched over from the sky. All right, well, I'm pressing A on that, and it doesn't seem to be interacting at all, so I don't think it's that. It's got to be this penguin, dude. Oh, there's something buried here. It's a letter. It says, to chatty. What? It's a message for her? To chatty. Okay. Did one of her friends go to a bunch of trouble to go to all of these different countries to hide these hints that thankfully no one else took? Or, like, wrote over or something? Pretty crazy if true. Man, we have already been live for an hour and a half. It does not feel like I've been playing the game for an hour and a half. I still think as long as this other side quest isn't, like, insanely long for some reason... We should still finish the main story today. Honestly, I really think that, like, with where we are in the game, we can finish the main story within about an hour. Maybe a little more. Maybe more like an hour and 20 minutes. 
and we've got about an hour and a half. So as long as, uh, as long as this is the end of this side quest, this has to be the end of this side quest. What else could they possibly add to this? But, uh, as long as the following one doesn't take super long, we should still be able to finish today. I should have waited a second longer to do that. Might have gotten all three. Oh, well. Don't talk to me. That was poorly timed twice. Thank you, Flicker Kick. Man, I wish we had more Flicker Kicks. Is there a wave hole in Big Wave? I don't think there is. I really do wish that there was a, uh... A wave hole just a little bit closer to the sky wave. I just remember Rogue SP is the thing. Yeah, that'll be fun. And by fun, I mean not fun at all. Reward 10 HP memory up. Honestly, that wouldn't be awful. Permanent HP gains in any Mega Man game are like super worth IMO. I hold HP memories in Star Force and Battle Network very highly. Probably higher than the average player. But I always consider them to be very worth. Because, like, I always want to use Link Power on other stuff, like more Giga Cards or maybe even more Mega Cards. But uh, I also don't want to be so low on HP that I'm easily killed. So I have to use, like, some of my Link Power for HP. I only came here to be rude and say that you're awesome and one of the best streamers out. I can't believe you've said this to me. That's, like, how could you just go to someone's stream and say something like that? Thanks for dropping in, big zaddies senpai. What a great name. You found a letter? No treasure? Let me see that. Sniff. It's from my granddad. This is really useless. Who needs it? You can have it. Okay. okay. Thanks for looking. All right. So we just got a stupid thing that like gives us a cipher mail. Lame. Very unfortunate. At least I assume that's what, where is it? Where is it? Old strap. A very vintage looking strap for a terminal used in the old days for a cell phone. Yeah, sure. Wave change on the air. Of course, it's Cypher Mail. Well, you know. You win some, you lose some. Some of the side quests are a little worthless. I still like to get them done anyway. Alright, you're the last person that I am aware of where a side quest is. So let's get it done and then go do the rest of the main game. Hey, I found a World of Food diary. Date XXX and supposed to be the world's best eater, but there's a food even I didn't know about. It's an urban legend among people who love soul food. What food is she talking about? Let's ask. Kind of interested to find out myself. Let's go talk to the world's best eater. Bud... Now watch this side quest be really easy and go by in a flash and then they give me like 20 HP up or something. Are you the world's number one gourmands? Mila Devour, I hate you. You're a sharp one, aren't you? This kid is like seven. I've heard rumors of really good soul food. Shh, quiet. Where do you hear that? I wouldn't know about it personally, but supposedly there's a lady in What's Up called the Soul Mother. The soul food she makes is simply divine. If you ever get some, you'd better tell me. Ah, oh, we gotta go all the way back to What's Up, of course we do. At least I'm at least we don't have to go to Mess Village. It takes way longer to get to Mess Village. Gourmand does not pron pronounce the D. It's just Gourmand. Gourmand? Why is there even a D there then? English is stupid. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I've ever heard the word Gourmand ever pronounced out loud, so I wouldn't know. I cannot ever remember a time in my life that I've heard that word pronounced. It's like Gora May? I don't know what that word is either. What does that even mean? I think it's Gourmet. So it's Gourmet like G-O-U-R-M-E-T? Because I thought that's how you spelled Gourmet. I know what the word Gourmet means. Oh, when you were spelling G-O-R-E-M-E-I, 
I thought that you were trying to say another word, but you were just saying how to pronounce it. My bad. Why is Gorman? You know what? It doesn't matter. I hate English. I have heard the word gourmet before. I know what that one means. Look at all these soon to be dead losers. We should try and. I think Taurus Fire SP, his uh, card right now is like default damage at 180. I'm pretty sure it can go up to like 250 or something. It should definitely be stronger than Ophiuchus card. So it might actually be worth our while to try to run into Taurus Fire SP again in Foodtopia sometime to try and kill him faster. But if we're gonna do that, we may as well wait until we have more like level three basic cards. Like do it in the post game so that we have a really good chance of killing him super quick. What's up? Go into what's up. Oh, why couldn't you have just moved one more over? Give me my triple. Goodbye. Love me some money. Once we get back to trying to finish the main game, I'm going to switch back to the Star Force just to do a bunch of damage. What's up? TV signals got jacked. Sorry, I didn't see it. We don't have any TVs. What's up? You have no TVs here? That's crazy. Who on earth is going to be the soul mother? You? Uh, I've never watched TV in my life. I'd like to try it just once. What's your yada yada? Who cares? Gotta be a person over here somewhere. What's up lines is such a large area. Is it you? Uh, TV signal's been jacked, yada yada. Surely when they said that it was like a lady in was up, they meant to go to was up, right? It wouldn't be like someone from was up in another area. I'd be really annoyed if that was the case. But also I feel like I've already, there wouldn't be someone like in the ruins, right? No, there shouldn't be anyone here. I don't think. Key word being shouldn't be. Where could I have missed an NPC? Did they, didn't they? they say old lady? They said soul mother. I don't know if they said old specifically, but I've also talked to every woman that I've seen. Or I, I thought I did at least. Welcome, welcome. Please enjoy yourself. What? What did you say? Some strange character Jack TV and they're going to take over the world. That sounds pretty serious. Oh, you don't freaking say. Interest brain prep. I wonder if it's actually one of those scenarios where I have to, like, find the person, but instead of talking to them, I have to go into their... Whatchamacallit? Fave food anything? Maybe it's you and I just need to look at your... Star Carrier? Because there was that one side quest we had before, right? Where instead of... I think it was Claude Pincer, he was, like, a fisherman or whatever. And instead of actually talking to him, we had to go into his, uh, star carrier. Let's see what we have. Hey, I found something called Long Life Diary, yada yada. Gave me a mess fish. The gods must be crazy to send him. Thanks. Oh, no, we had a side quest for you where we had to get you that fish. Right. Huh. What's up, huh, Vega, yada yada. I'm gonna talk to the males now as well, because maybe one of them will mention the soul mother. I don't know, I feel like I've talked to every NPC already. Uh, something big is happening on TV, I gotta see it. Wait, we don't have any in What's Up. How do you know there's something big happening on it then? Am I losing my mind? Uh-huh, Vega, what's up with her? Okay. Feel like I've talked to everyone? Do I need to find a What's Up person, like a What's Up NPC that is not in What's Up? That would be a little whack of the game to ask me to do that. I mean, what's up isn't- unless they're in the ruins? I'm- dude, I'm actually gonna Google this one. This is weird. Mega Man, Star Force 2, Soul Mother? Yeah, 
Here we go, side quest of soul food. Oh, there is a person all the way back where you fought Terra Condor. Okay. I just wanted to make sure that I needed to go all the way back in the Was Up Ruins and look around here before I wasted my time doing it. It's really weird for them to spawn an NPC so far back when, like, normally in dungeon areas like this, that wouldn't happen. Kind of weird. Oh, there you are. You don't even look like a Was Up person. What the heck? My, why these leaves could would be perfect for seasoning. Excuse me, ma'am, but are you the soul mother? My Maya haven't been called that in ages. I'd really like to eat some of your soul food. Is that why you came all this way? I just happen to have some soul food hot out of the kitchen. Take some with you. All right. Come again any time. Later, loser. That's a bit of a weird one, but okay. Let's go turn in this side quest, and then I think we're done on side quest chat. I think we're just going to go finish the main story then. By the current quest so far, long quests have horde rewards while short ones have good ones. Apparently. Hot out of the kitchen, did she cook that on the stones? Yeah, there's an oven right around the corner that Terra Condor was using. Don't worry. Don't think about it. Don't put too much thought into it. Sky wave. All right, we're gonna go back to Echo Ridge, then we're gonna go straight to the what should we call it? Oh my word, what is this? Oh, give me Darkness Hole. Yes, insta win. I love this Giga card. I'm so mad that it's in the Ninja version of the game instead of the Zerker. If you're fighting regular viruses and they have 250 or less health, they die. If you're fighting a boss and he has 500 or less health, he dies. Fantastic. I love that card. But uh, we're going to go turn this in at Grizzly Peaks, and then we're going to immediately go right back to the Sky Wave, go to the Bermuda Maze, and uh, go to the boss, or go to the final area of the game. I'm pretty sure once we get back through the... We have to go back to the Bermuda Maze, and then there's like a little mini maze we have to go through, but it's not as long as the first time. As the first maze we went through with Heart Note. And once we get through that, we basically just go into the final dungeon of the game, and we go until the game is over. I mean, we still got about an hour and... About an hour and 20 minutes. I... It might be a... Might be cutting it a little close, but I do think we're gonna just finish the game today. Worst case scenario, we get, like, to right before the final boss, and then we, uh, wrap up there. I don't think the final dungeon is too long, because there's, like, they don't put a lot of fluff around it. I think they kind of put you right into it, and then you just start doing the dungeon puzzle. And making your way through. We'll see. It might be longer than I remember. But it would be pretty neat. We've made good progress on side quests and SP bosses today because we finished Plasio Surf and Queen Ophiaca. So it would be pretty good to finish the main story today. And then next time we can, next stream we can really bunker down on finishing up, on finishing up SP bosses like Terra Condor. We might try and fight Taurus Fire again. Uh, Yeti Blizzard. We need to do Yeti Blizzard. We'll have to do Dark Phantom, because Dark Phantom hasn't been available yet, but he's available after you do the main story. We'll have Harp Note, Rogue, and Hollow, I believe. We'll need to do all of those SP fights. Lemieux kind of annoying, though. Yeah. Yeah, Lemieux can be pretty annoying, but I think we'll be able to beat him. You, is that it? Is that soul food? Let me have some. Hmm, this is so good. This soul food is great. I owe you one. This one is, is for you. Words. Yo, HP memory 10. Every bit of HP helps. My theory holds true now. Short side quest good, long side quest bad. Yeah. You've, uh, you've got a good... You've got a pretty decent, uh, sample size that supports you right now. Alright, boys. 
We're going to the end of the game. Let's do it. Let's see if I can beat the rest of the main story in the next hour and 20 minutes, give or take. If we're like right at the very end of the game and we've only got like five minutes left, I might just try and go a little over today to get it done because Mega Man streams are normally a bit shorter anyways. 